But first, we start tonight with Arizona Governor Katie Hobbs set to face a Maricopa County judge this week to answer questions about her decision to not carry out a scheduled execution. Good Sunday evening. I'm Jonathan McCall. I'm Rachel Cole. Team 12's Chase Golightly is live for us up in the Alert Center with the reason the judge wants to hear from the governor and the state's prison director as well. Chase? That's right, Rachel. Jonathan, Governor Hobbs and the state's prison director will be in court the same day the execution for Aaron Gunches was set to be carried out. Now, Gunches was convicted about two decades ago for murdering Ted Price near Mesa back in 2002. He was ordered to be executed by lethal injection when Hobbs stepped in. While the Supreme Court ruled that according to state law, the governor does not have to carry out the execution, she must now tell the court why her decision does not violate the constitutional rights of victims entitled to prompt justice. Attorney Benjamin Taylor explains what that means. So ultimately, victims have a right. There's no exact date that they're under the law that they have to have this person executed, but they have rights to prompt and swift and speedy justice too, just like a defendant has a right not to have cruel and unusual punishment. And coming up tonight at 12 News at 10, we're diving deeper into this case and the burden of proof the state will have to provide. For now, we're live in the Alert Center. Chase Lightly, 12 News. Chase, we'll see you at 10 o'clock. Thanks.